In this video, we'll be looking at modals that express advisability or suggestions, expectations, and ability and possibility. Let's begin. Expressing advisability and suggestions with should, ought to, had better, and could. Should and ought to express advisability. This could be a mild suggestion or a statement about responsibility or duty. The negative form of this is shouldn't. Here's an example. The driver should get gas very soon or the driver ought to get gas very soon. So if your gas tank is on empty like that, this is good advice. So um, this should or ought to express advisability. Had better. Had better expresses stronger advice than should or ought to. Had better implies a warning or a threat of possible bad consequences. The negative of this is had better not. For example, the driver had better get gas right away or risk getting stranded on the freeway. So this is a little bit stronger than should and there's that idea of there's a warning there or there's a threat of something bad that could happen. Could is used to make possible suggestions. The suggestion given is one possibility or an option. So could is not as strong as should or ought to. For example, I'm having trouble understanding this grammar. You could look up the further resources or you could email the professor. So these are like options. They're suggestions, but they are more like possible options. It's not a very strong suggestion. Expressing expectation with be supposed to and should. Be supposed to expresses the idea that someone expects something to happen. And be supposed to expresses expectations about scheduled events, procedures, and behavior. Let's take a look at examples for each of these three. Sentence one, the lecture is supposed to end at 6 p.m. So this is a scheduled event. So it expresses an expectation about a scheduled event. Sentence two, when a class evaluates an instructor, a student is supposed to take the evaluation forms to the office. This shows procedures. Those are the procedures that happen at a school when a class evaluates an instructor. And uh, sentence three, the children are supposed to put away their own toys. This is behavior. These are expectations about behavior. What behavior um, children are expected to do. Now should also expresses expectation. Here's an, an example. My package should arrive today or tomorrow. So I'm expecting it to arrive today or tomorrow. Now keep in mind this is different than should expressing advice. So should has more than one meaning. In this case it expresses expectation. Let's look at expressing ability. We can use these modals, can, know how to, and be able to, to express ability. Can expresses physical ability, and it's frequently used with the five senses. See, hear, feel, smell, taste, and it expresses a learned skill. The negative is can't or cannot, spelled as one word. For example, I can smell dinner cooking. Know how to expresses a learned skill, something that you learn. Number two, Nora can play violin or Nora knows how to play violin. So the violin is a learned skill, so we can use know how to for that. But it's also a physical ability, so we can use can as well. Be able to expresses ability and the negative is not able or unable. I'm unable to reach the highest shelf. So in this case, I don't have the ability 
to reach the highest shelf because I'm too short. Expressing possibility with can, may, and might. Can expresses a general possibility. For example, language students can really improve their speaking by having a conversation partner. So this is a general possibility. It is possible for language students to improve by having a conversation partner. May or might um, express present or future possibility. That means there is a chance when it's about the future. There's a chance that something might happen. For example, this book may be cheaper online or this book might be cheaper online. So this is a present possibility. It is possible that the book is cheaper online. It may rain tomorrow or it might rain tomorrow. This is a future possibility. That means there is a chance of rain tomorrow.